Hey guys, so I have this video for you today. This is another video using the new Vice 4 palette and I absolutely love the way this came out. And this was using all shimmer, can you believe it, except for the brow bone. So I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is apply my MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot. I'm going to apply that all over my lid, up to my brow, and I'm going to apply it on my lower lash line as well. Next I'm taking my NYX eyeshadow and I have a headache and I'm just applying that as my brow bone highlight and I'm not sure why I did this before the tape, you can do it after. <laughs> so I just applied that under the brow and then pulled it down into the crease. So next I'm applying a piece of tape to the outer corner of my eye. You can do this at whatever angle you think flatters your eyes the most. I like to do it kind of going outwards. Then I'm taking this Lavish Lilac Chubby Stick for Eyes by Clinique and I'm applying that all over my lids to give a nice base for the eyeshadow to stick into. And just a warning, you're going to want to do your face after the eyes um, because you get so much fallout. So first I'm going to go in with the shade Harlot, which is such a beautiful kind of lavender lilac color and I'm applying that all over the lid into that base and then I'm also bringing it up into my crease pretty heavily. Then I'm going in with a shade Discreet and that's what I'm going to use to blend out the shade Harlot. So I'm just going in and diffusing that line. Then I'm taking the shade Low and I'm going to start building up my outer corner with this because I want it to be nice and intense. So I go in and I pack on this color and then I come in with a fluffy blending brush just to blend it out and make sure it's all nice and diffused and soft. Now I'm taking the shade Grip, which the only way I could describe this is like smoke. Like, you know, smoke you see in the air. Um, it's amazing with this little micro glitter. So I'm just putting it over the shade Harlot and it really just gives it this cool like smoky effect. And now I'm going in with the shade Deadbeat and I'm going to pack that on the outer corner because I really wanted to intensify this look. So I'm just going in and it's like light layers. I'm just packing that shade on and going in with the fluffy blending brush again and just blending it all out making sure it's nice and diffused and then packing on more color and blending it out. Next I'm going in with the shade bones and I'm going to apply that as my inner corner highlight. Now we're just going to peel off that tape to reveal the final product and I'm going to go in with a wipe and clean up that fallout. You can see there's a ton so I just did my face and now I'm going in with my MAC Smolder Eye Coal and I'm lining my upper and lower water lines. And now I'm going in with my favorite liquid liner. This is the Jessie's Girl liquid liner. And I'm first going to start by just lining my lash line and then I'm going to create the wing and I'm going to just follow that line we created on the outer corner. So now I'm just going to trace that line and then drag my liner pen backwards and then just fill in the triangle it creates. And then I'm just going to blend it in with that line that I created before. Now I started by applying my uh, MAC Giga Black Lash to my lower lashes and then halfway through realized that I didn't do my lower lash line. So I went back in with the shade Harlot and I just pushed it up against my lower lash line and I really loved the way it looked with that kind of brighter pop of purple underneath so I literally just left it like that then went in with these shy kiss lashes which I've been absolutely obsessed with lately they're like one of my new favorite lashes ever and after that you are all done I hope you guys enjoyed the look I absolutely love the way this came out so if you like it too don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already I will definitely be doing more looks with this palette so yeah stay tuned for that and I will talk to you guys soon bye